underneath the hanging tree. Hello, my name is Jamel Gaines. I'm the artistic director of Creative Outlet. Uh, it's important for us to continue the, the uh, commemoration of Juneteenth. Um, lots going on in our world right now, and um, this is a special time, an important time to be able to teach. And if we can use the arts as a tool and a social, cultural piece to teach, we're good. Ladies and gentlemen, let's celebrate Juneteenth. This is a rose-hued, drenched in blood libation. This is a we will shout your name in full breath and never allow you to be forgotten libation. This is your whole bloodline on both sides of your DNA libation. This, this water, this holy water, we pour this sacred water to clear a path for us to live our way through without having to look over our shoulders as we exit our home. We pour this libation in remembrance of you whose names we call, whose names we have uttered in clear voices. We will not allow you to be forgotten. The reason that Juneteenth is important to me is because my parents, both Liberian, my mother and my father, Sierra Leonean, I remember my father sharing a story with me about slave ships still coming to the edge of the shores in Freetown, Sierra Leone to transport black bodies to America, far beyond the Emancipation Proclamation, far beyond our American blacks knowing that they were free on Juneteenth in this country. When I think of our freedom, our history, our legacy, our music, I think of my parents who in their lives were able to come from Liberia and Sierra Leone and live in this here America. My being born in the hospital across the street from this very ground in Fort Greene Park. Thank you, our ancestors. I'm so glad that we were notified, even if it took up to three years to tell our people that we were free. Juneteenth now defines that we are and will always be free. History matters, black culture matters, black spirituality matters, black gods matter, black dance matter, black music matters. We have to understand that constantly and always and know that we also are American. Remember the body. Remember me as I am. This is how I come to you the clawing pus of death, from a time of rebellion on crags above the river, after the nightful war reached harbor. Death became the prison house of the soul, cartloads of corpses buried beneath the breast of the beach sand. Time come and go. No one sees me drowning. I become me in the second house of time.
Underneath the hanging tree 